Yo, what is up guys? Today we're going to be doing a tier list of all of the maps and this is going to be my opinion. It's not necessarily going to be objective or anything like that, but we're going to be ranking best to worst. So here are the tiers. On this one, that means it's my favorite. This one, I'll say it's good. This one is I hate being beast, but I might probably like it playing as survivor. This one is I'll literally leave the game if this map shows up and the last rank is I think it needs to be deleted. That's how horrible it is. So just just keep in mind, I probably won't have much down here because I pretty much like all of the maps. So we're gonna see. We're starting off with Abandoned Prison. So, and this is the current Abandoned Prison. So I'm gonna be ranking the older Abandoned Prison later on. So the current Abandoned Prison, I would probably put it right here. This is a pretty obvious one. If you watch my videos, you know I hate being beast on Abandoned Prison. I feel like it's more geared towards survivors. I think my main issue with this map is the weaponry room and like the vent that's right there. Basically all three of those computers I would say are really annoying for the beast. So that's why I put it right here. I feel like this is easier for survivors to win this map and I wouldn't really say it's even between the beast and the survivor so that's why I put it here. Now library. I really love library. I feel like I want to put it. Oh it's, it is kind of my favorite. It's, it is between these two. I'm gonna have to say it's good just because because the only thing negative I have to say about it is sometimes it does lag. It is pretty big, but the thing is I do really like big maps. I think when it first came out, I hated it just because it was hard to memorize. But now that I've memorized it, I really love this map. I think a lot of people do hate library though. And I wish more people loved it. I wish more people selected this map in the map voting, but yeah. School map. So this is one of the new maps. I was pretty excited about school map when it first came out because we finally got like something new and like a new theme. But currently Currently, I probably put it right here because it's kind of boring. So I kind of leave the game whenever this map shows up. So I don't know how many people agree with me on this one. It is kind of like silly because there's interactive things in the map and stuff. But other than that, it's kind of boring. So abandoned facility. So I'm ranking the old abandoned facility, the original when it first came out, 2017 version. I have mixed feelings about this map because it was super fun fun playing this map but at the same time I feel like it was unfair for the beast because of the vents. I don't know how many of you played this map but back when I was playing it I never really hated being the beast on it. I really liked this map because it was so different from prison map and facility. So I don't know. I want to see say it wasn't my favorite map back then but I really did love it so I put it here and I know it's not necessarily a balanced map but I really like this map back then so that's why I'm putting it here now we're ranking the 2017 abandoned prison man this is a hard one because it's kind of the same deal with this map like it's kind of is a bad map but it was fun playing it back then because we were so used to just playing the facility map and when we got a new map it was really fun man this one is this one's tough to rate because the basketball courtroom was unfair for the survivors. But I think other than that, yeah, I would say the basketball room and the conference room was unfair for the survivors. So, man. I didn't hate the old version back then, weirdly enough. I would probably put it on the same ranking as the revamped version of it. Forgotten Facility. Forgotten Facility is called Forgotten Facility for a reason because it's a forgotten map. Like, literally nobody cares about this map. I don't know. The, the thing is, I kind of have fun playing this map, but it's also so boring that I hate it. Imagine I put it here. No. I'm gonna put it on this one. Sometimes I will play it just because, but I feel like I would leave the game on this map, so I'm gonna put it there. Sewer treatment plant. One of the new maps, um, I don't know how I feel about this one. I think I haven't really played it enough because no one really chooses this map. I'll put it on, I hate being the beast on this on this map because I don't really know the map that well. So it's not as fun being the beast on this map. I don't know, yeah, I'm gonna put it there. Airport, I mean, this is a pretty easy one. I would say it's one of my favorites because it's so simple. There's really like nothing much 
much wrong with it. I think all the balance fixes have been done on this map. Like the revamp was actually really good for airport. I'm gonna put it number one. Now, 2017 version of facility. Man, I'm gonna have to say it's my favorite map. It is my favorite map back then. Even though it had some issues, like the cinema had a vent and it only had one door. That's an issue. The blue rooms didn't have like the border. The beast could just walk right past it and see if someone was hacking in there and they made it super easy for the beast it's very simple it's really good but i think it did need the fixes on it but it definitely was my favorite map back then so i'm gonna put it number one as well haunted mansion the reason i like haunted mansion is because it somewhat reminds me of the library map but i don't know if i would put it i kind of do want to put it here i think this map doesn't have very much vents to it hmm i would say it really was fun playing it especially in like the halloween times i'm gonna put it's good but i don't think i put favorite back rooms if you have seen my videos and my gameplay on this map you will know i absolutely hated this map and i advocated for this map being deleted it needed to be deleted and i'm glad it got deleted hopefully it's deleted for good and it never comes back because this has to be one of the worst maps to be created. I just, I don't understand this map. I think the backrooms idea was a good idea because of like the horror theme, but I think there should have been something more creative added to it. So it wasn't just like a bunch of randomness. It's basically just a random maze. A lot of the PCs would spawn super close together and there's just no originality in it. I hate it. It's horrible. It's horrible. That's, that's all that needs to be said. Now we're going to rank facility. We're talking about the current facility. I have mixed feelings about facility currently um not that it's not any much different from the 2017 version but i'm thinking about back in 2017 when i was playing flea this was my favorite map but if we're talking about currently i played this map so many times because this is the first map on flea facility so it's kind of hard for me to say it's my favorite but i definitely like don't hate being beast on it i'm just gonna say it's good but just because of how many times i've played it and we're talking 2024 here i'm just gonna put it in it's it's good laboratory complex so another new map i think i've also haven't played this enough i think i really love the theme on this map the darkness that it has the lights the horror theme i do really like it the thing is i haven't even exp fully explored this map i haven't even been upstairs that many times because i don't even know how to get upstairs so i would say i hate being beast on this map because i don't know the map and i'd rather be survivor because i feel like there's more exploration and being survivor i also hate like the fake doors on this map that's probably one of the biggest reasons i hated backrooms because the fake doors there was way too many fake doors eventually i did fully memorize the map pretty fast and all like the fake doors but it still didn't make this map any better but yeah i'm probably gonna leave this right here nuclear power plant map i don't know where i want to put this one because when it first came out again there's the excitement when maps first come out but then afterwards that fades away and you got to think about is this really Really a good map for flee the facility i really like the lights on it and the interactive parts of this map i think they did this map better than the school map so i would probably put this on it's good it's not my favorite but i did really love the map when it came out and i think i still do love the map i will still play this map if it comes up so i'm gonna put this right here now abandoned facility optimus i think they did this really well in preserving the original abandoned facility and i think that's where they messed up when they last revamped this map is they completely changed the format of the map and turned it into an an entirely new map and i think that's where they went wrong nobody liked playing the revamp of abandoned facility no one really selected this map but i think they kind of revived it a little bit with the abandoned facility optimus because they kept the original flare in there but all they did was fix it the same way that they did with airport and prison i think they did really well with fixing the balance issues on this map and they still kept the old nostalgic feel on abandoned facility so i would definitely put this on it's good now we have homestead homestead is 
a very simple map. It's pretty good that way. I gotta say Homestead is my favorite map. It doesn't really need anything to it. It doesn't really need any fixes to Homestead. It's pretty much a perfect Fleet of Facility map. But I don't know if I really like the high detail on Fleet of Facility maps. After like ranking all the maps, I kind of want to put Library up here. Because now that I think of it, I do really like Library. It's got to be my one of my favorite maps. So I'm going to put it up there. I'm happy with where I ranked everything. I don't know if I'm missing a map. Hopefully I'm not. I want y'all guys' opinion on my tier list. And I want to know where you disagree with me the most. And I want to know your guys' top favorite maps on Fleet of Facility and your top hated maps on Fleet of Facility. And also comment down below what kind of map themes that you would like to be added to Fleet of Facility. Other than that... So I'm using Night Fox's old videos to kind of give me an idea because I don't have old footage of the maps. So I know there's some of you guys out here that wasn't playing Fleet Facility back in 2017. So if you're not aware of what the maps used to look like, you can check out um, Night Fox's videos on it made six years ago. When Fleet could flop like this, those were some of the best times on Fleet Facility. It was a really simple game. There was only like two to three maps and those were really fun times. Oh, I remember uh, this room. I remember there used to be a tube in the TV room and people would just go under like the tables. And once they had a chance, they would jump from this table to the table on the other side of this vent and they would use that to save the person and then they'd go right under the pool table. Okay, so if y'all don't know what the old abandoned facility used to look like, this is basically what it looked like uh there's a lot of changes that have been made to it so this room right here had a vent so it had a vent and one door and basically what would happen is the beast had to go back and forth with the door and the hallway right here and the person would just camp in this vent and it was super hard to get people right here and that was really super annoying so what they did with the abandoned facility optimus is they removed this vent and they added like a window and then on this part you used to be able to sit on the sofas and you could like juke the beast right here and make the beast sit down on the sofa and so that you could run away so that was another cool thing about this map but i guess they removed that because people hated that and then this room only had a door and a window and nothing on the other end of the room so if the beast found you in this room you either had to hide and hope that the beast doesn't find you or try and juke your way out of it or either you could have this door open and just be ready to go through the door or the window so this room wasn't too bad but it was sometimes a tough spot if you're playing against a good beast oh and also this the server room had a vent so when the beast would find you in this room you could just go through the vent and then they had to get out of this room and go all the way around to try and get you in the painting room so that was also annoying for the beast i think the main issue with this map was also the really long hallways for survivors but you know you still had fun times on the old abandoned facility so i can't really complain too much about the old map of this because it was still really fun to play at least in those pastimes of flea when you can like literally walk when you're after your hit i don't know what you would call it like a flop walk mm -hmm. 